Hey my fire signs and welcome to my channel. This is Indigo here with Indigo Goddess 1111. I'm here bringing you your July 27th daily love outlook. Sorry, if it could happen, it did. Yes. What do we got going on in love today? My cards. There we go. I think we're ready. I lost with the deck here. What can fire signs expect? Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, in that order, please. Aries, you have the Eight of Cups in reverse. Sagis, you have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. And Leo, you guys have the Queen of Cups. Nice. All right. Your guys' overall issue of the day is the Ace of Swords in reverse. So definite confusion in this energy that we're dealing with today. Um, the clarifier for the Ace of Swords in reverse is the Eight of Swords. So uh, feeling stuck, trapped, not sure how you're going to get out of the situation you're currently in. You're confused. You don't know why or what or where. Um, all you know is it's here and you're dealing with it. All right. Why is Aries have the Eight of Cups here in reverse? Most flew out. All right. So Aries, you guys, um, you guys are refusing to move on from a emotionally draining situation. Um, you're kind of putting the blinders on. You're you're refusing to look at the facts. You have a choice to make and you're not wanting to make it because uh, you're scared of the outcome. You're scared of the future and what it entails for you. You're also um, suffering for some, from some heartbreak. You're refusing to move on from this uh, relationship, from this situation. Um, your choice is whether to stay or go and you're staying in this, uh, this emotionally heartbreaking situation uh, that you're in. Um, you're going to kind of feel this energy for the next couple of days, actually. Uh, you will uh, have a moment here in the next couple of days of clarity to where this is going to lift in the upright, and you are going to have the strength to move forward, to move on um, from this situation. Saggies, you guys have the Eight of Pentacles with the Seven of Pentacles, dealing with some Earth sign. Wow, bottom of the deck, Virgo. Most definitely dealing with a Virgo. Um, you are growing impatient. You're starting to wonder if this is ever going to happen. Um, on this side of the card, he's putting in his hard work, or he put in all the hard work. Now he's sitting there waiting for his blessings to come in. On this side, he's still waiting. He's wondering if this is ever going to happen. So you're starting to wonder if all this hard work was for, for nothing. Um, you're still confused on where this relationship is going, if it's going anywhere. Um, the person you're waiting on could be feeling like they're stuck. Um, you could now be possibly feeling, you could have been waiting so long for somebody that now you're confused. You don't know what to do. Um, let me get one more card for the Seven of Pentacles here. The Tower, yeah. So um, you're just waiting for that moment. You're waiting uh, for your person that you're dealing with to have this Tower moment so, so that you guys can move forward is the situation I'm getting for this group of people. But you guys are very confused. You're not sure why you're still waiting. You're, you've gotten to that point where you've waited so long, you're not sure why you're still there waiting. Why is the Queen of Cups here for Leo? Whoa, that flew out of there. Okay, so you, uh, Leos, you're dealing with a female uh, in your life. Uh, doesn't necessarily have to be even a love interest. Could be a mom, a sister, an aunt. Um, they are manipulating the situation to try to get you to do something that they want you to do. Um, you're very confused. Um, because you're trying to follow your heart. You're wanting to, um, yeah, you're wanting to move forward. You're wanting to move on. You want to get out of this feeling stuck. You want clarity. You want answers. And all you're getting is somebody playing with your mind, uh, playing, you know, playing head games with you. You are going to break out of this energy, Leo, though, however, and you're going to be very successful in finding your own self again, finding your own truth, your own voice, um, standing your own ground. And you're going to follow your heart. Which is exactly what uh, it needs to be done. What is the card for the day for our fire signs? Trust. This situation is calling for you to trust. So um, trust, trust your instincts. Uh, trust your gut. 
But more importantly, trust your higher power, trust your higher self. Uh, the angels and everyone um, in the heavens is doing what they have to do to shift you into where you need to be during this energy, especially today. Um, trust the situation. Have faith. Have faith in your journey. This is only one part of your destination, or one part of your journey, not your destination. So trust what you're going through is what you what needs to happen in order for you to get exactly where you need to be. So fire signs, um, keep the faith, have trust, and as always, have a beautiful day. Love, light, and God bless.